I'm a big fan of the UFO flying mount, and so when I saw this cute Nimbus mount mod, I had to try it out. And so it's not that hard to make, apparently. You just need some soles of flight, some cloud, and then a Nimbus rod. And then you can make it. So pretty easy to make. But what we're going to do is we're going to cheat. We're just going to spawn this thing. So I'm going to add it and I'm going to remove my cosmic car key and see exactly what it is we're dealing with here. I've never tested this out. There he is. Whoa! Look how fast this is. I thought the UFO mount was pretty fast, but this is... Uh, I mean, just take a look at the screen there. You can see, especially on the diagonal, just how fast this thing can go. And it's not just the top speed. The acceleration is just out of this world. I don't know how a cloud really, quite frankly, does it. But this cloud is amazing. I love it. So it's time to customize our cloud. It's not that elaborate an image. It's really quite the, the blank canvas. So just in case you're not aware, you can use dyes on pretty much anything in this game, even without T-Mod Loader, but certainly in this case, T-Mod Loader and the Cheat Sheet Mod makes selecting an appropriate die for my Nimbus mount rather easy. So I'm going to try just a few different ones, and I, I'm not really that keen on the white. This one is good. It's kind of like a hot rod color. I quite like that one. I don't think I'll be giving this mount up anytime soon. It's just that nice. Um, I'll add that this mount doesn't dismount you if you go in water, which is another kind of feather in its cap. You can stay, and if you go down into the ocean or some other lake, it won't dismount you. So that's super convenient when exploring. It's a great little mod, great mount, and I just need to settle on a color. As I said, this hot rod color's pretty solid, you know, to each their own. Everyone has their own taste. Using the Cheat Sheet mod makes this selection rather easy. I'm kind of spoiled for choice, really. Um, so unless something beats out the hot rod color, I think I'm probably going to settle on that. A lot of them don't seem to do much in the way of adding to its personality. A lot of the adjustments are rather dull or subtle. Uh, so, so far the hot rod has it. I'm just going to try a few more and then I'm going to move along because I think you'll want to see what this does when you fight the Moon Lord. So at the end of the video I'm going to fight the Moon Lord and we can figure out exactly... Whoa! I like this one. I think this is going to be it guys. This is a nice little effect and... Okay. And so, sorry I cut off there. I just wanted to show this. So nice little tool tip there for your Nimbus mount. And there he is. Beautiful, right? So anyway, as uh, promised, I think we ought to fight the Moon Lord and really put this thing through its face. So here we go. Fast mount. And as I said, flying at the diagonal, <laughs> I'm outrunning the Moon Lord. And wow, that's not happening. Or has anyone seen that actually happen before? It kind of respawned the Moon Lord. The Moon Lord has to get to catch up to this flying mount. It's so fast. It's actually got to respawn, and in doing so, it has that bright flash of light again. I've never seen that before. So, yeah, this is this is too much even for the Moon Lord. And I suspect you could really just kind of kite the Moon Lord with this thing. So. Great mod. Um, I'd imagine the twins and other hard mode bosses are not going to be as fast as this thing. You can basically outrun anything in this mount. So it's super fast. Best thing you can have instead of a teleporter or a pylon. And again, it doesn't dismount you when you're in water. So it's got a high utility. I think it looks pretty adorable too. And adorable in a kind of sci-fi way with this... I forget if it's the Vortex die or what. But you can obviously customize it to your liking um so yeah great mod i think i'm gonna replace my cosmic car key with this so thanks for watching everyone and i'll see you in the next video